Blank Park Zoo's rhinos are a highly endangered subspecies of rhinoceros called the Eastern Black Rhino. They require expert care, and it's a task that animal keepers take seriously because rhino populations are very small. With help from other zoos and visitors like you, there is a chance to save the rhino from extinction. Supervisor Lisa Ashburn starts the day with a health check of the animals. Um, so one of the things we do with our rhinos every day is check their eye color. We want to um, look for any signs of jaundice in the rhino, which may be indicative of an anemic condition. We also want to check open for any mouth sores or lesions. Um, I'm also checking his temperature by feeling his ears, seeing what they feel like and doing an all-over body inspection, looking for any sores or ulcers. Next, the keepers and rhinos go through a positive training program where they work on husbandry and medical behaviors. This aids in their health care. The goal of this program would be to do procedures like drawing blood or completing an ultrasound without risky sedation. We also want to provide enrichment to these animals. So in this case, Keanu has a large ball and a weeble. Rhinos are prone to skin conditions such as dryness, so a priority for keepers is to keep their skin healthy. Keepers do this by giving the rhinos a bath and applying moisturizing agents to their skin. The building is also equipped with showers to give the rhinos additional moisture. So just how much does a rhino eat every day? While the answer changes based on the size and age of each rhino, the male rhino currently eats 30 pounds of hay and 7 pounds of grain a day. The female eats even more. The grain is actually a pelleted feed designed for rhinos and it contains a high percentage of fiber. So there's a lot of aspen wood in this grain as well as beet pulp. Treats for the rhino include produce such as carrots and sweet potatoes. Rhinos also like to eat browse, that is branches and shrubbery. You can see this pointed lip, which would aid in stripping leaves and branches um, from shrubbery. And of course, this high fiber diet provides plenty of work for the keepers when all this food comes out the other end. Up to 50 pounds of scat a day per rhino. So stalls are cleaned, hosed, and scrubbed daily and disinfected weekly. The building that houses the rhinos has many special features. In order to keep odors to a minimum, a massive ventilation system has been installed and provides over seven complete air exchanges per hour. A special squeeze cage keeps accurate weights of the animals and assists in performing veterinary procedures. A unique rubber floor, similar to what you might find at a track and field meet, has been added to several areas to cushion the concrete. And finally, all the doors that shift the animals from one stall to the next are controlled by hydraulics so keepers can move the animals safely. So I'm often asked if we go in with the rhinos, and the answer to that is no. We always interact with them from the other side of a barrier. This form of animal management is called protected contact. While rhinos enjoy human interaction, their eyesight is poor, and their instinct is to charge when startled. This type of management helps keepers and rhinos stay safe. The zoo also uses protected contact with other large mammals like the great cats and giraffe. Thanks for visiting and enjoy the rest of your day at Blank Park Zoo, Iowa's wildest adventure.